Welcome ladies and gentlemen. So what I'd like to do is show you how to simplify this uh, monomial rational radical expression by uh, rationalizing the denominator. Now there's an uh, important point that I want to make about this is that we know that the square root of x times the square root of x is just going to equal x because that becomes the square root of x squared which equals x. However, the, square, the cube root of x times the cube root of x um, equals the cube root of x squared where we cannot simply take the cube root. So when we, want to, um, when we want to be able to rationalize the denominator here, what we want to do is, or if I want to get rid of the cube root of something, and I have the cube root of x, I want to be able to multiply that by the cube root of x squared. Because now when I multiply these, I get the cube root of x cubed, which now is going to equal x. So I'm looking to rationalize the denominator. I'm not going to want to rationalize the denominator by 5y. I'm going to want to rationalize the denominator by 5y, or 5 squared, y squared. And whatever I do in the bottom, I have to do up top. All right, now notice, now that's obviously 5 squared is 25. Um, and then 25 times 5 is going to be uh, 125. Um, all right, so let's just rewrite this as 25y squared. Let's make this a little bit easier. All right, so let's go and do the numerator first here. So when I do the numerator, I can multiply my radicands together. So I have the cube root of 6 times 25 is going to be 150. x squared times y squared is just x squared times y squared. Uh, now I want to be able to look at, you know, can I simplify that all? I look at my cube numbers. I look at 8. Um, I look at 27 and look at 60, you know, 64. Um, none of those I see are divisible by, or um, 150 is divisible by any of those numbers. And then I just multiply here, which I have the cube root of 125 times y cubed. Well, now I can take the cube root of 125, which is just going to be 5, and the cube root of y cubed, which is just going to be um, y. So therefore, I have 3 cube root of 150x squared y squared divided by 125y. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you simplify by rationalizing the denominator of a cube root. Thanks.